But we do begin with Governor Gretchen Whitmer preparing to give her response to President Trump's State of the Union address tonight. When the president is finished, all eyes will turn here to the Michigan and our governor as she delivers the response for the Democrats. The governor spoke about her plans just a few minutes ago as she says she'll focus on what she calls dinner table issues. She'll discuss infrastructure, the path to good jobs, health care, expanding overtime and democratic action on various bills to help seniors and others. The governor will make the speech from her daughter's high school in East Lansing. Our children are the future of our country and it's on all of us to build a better future for them. At the end of the day, it really doesn't matter what people say. What matters is what we do. So when the president speaks tonight, I'm not going to focus so much on what he says. I'm going to be focusing on actions that have been taken, actions that are happening um, across the country, especially in Democratic-led states. Governor Whitmer was also asked about a bid for vice president. Take a listen. So if that call came, the answer would be no. Tim, I'm going to take anyone's call if it comes, but here's the thing. I am not interested in going to Washington, D.C. I never have been. I would encourage any candidate who uh, gets to that point to look very closely at my good friend Stacey Abrams. She would be a phenomenal running mate. Now, Governor Whitmer says if President Trump does something unexpected in his State of the Union speech tonight, she will be prepared to address it. And, of course, you can watch the State of the Union live at on 7 right here tonight starting at 9 p.m. And Governor Whitmer will speak as soon as the president is finished. We will be streaming that all for you on WXYZ.com.